a Winnipeg version of a classic. Broom. 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 So it baby! Jets have swept Connor McDavid sponsored Edmonton Oilers for nothing. The final score 4 3 in, in triple overtime. It oh is currently 1 47 a.m. We are recording this. You know why? Because we love doing this because you guys are so fucking amazing. And my and God, we're on, we're you know on, we got so much energy. We just have to do. I, I can't fucking sleep. How am I gonna be able to sleep with this shit? Like, <sighs> I'm just so amped up. Oh my God. Oh my God. I've had so much to drink because every OT, I'm like, I gotta get a new right. shot because yeah, the boys you, you've had so cannot lose. Yeah. Da 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 da. da, da. Da, 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 the hella bunkers falling down. Oh, not the hella bunker. The Russell bench. The other goalie shit that we have. The other goalie gimmick. Nice. What in the Jesus Christ? What? You know, you know how Jesus can turn water into wine. It would be amazing right now if he could do the opposite. <laughs> <laughs> Mmm, a little bit of the bubbly. Oh, a little bit of the bubbly. <laughs> we did it. We did it. Guys, people who are new to this channel, people who have been watching since my game one reaction, thank you so much. We have passed the first round. I don't give a fuck what anyone has to say. Do I sound cocky? I'm sorry if I do. I am just fucking thankful because I don't know how to explain in proper human English that how excited I am about this. Zach, you uh, checked the money puck stats before the playoffs started. Fuck the money puck stats. What was the odds that the Jets the, were uh, the odds are, in a I sweep? Will, the odds that the Jets win this in a sweep, I'm glad you asked, were under 4%, I believe. Guess what? 4% is trending, bitches. Also, somebody told me, I think his name was Jared Ross, I could be wrong, told me to say, uh, hella trust, because in Helly we do trust. Oh, because that's, yeah, fuck. That's, that's my buddy Jared. <laughs> so, yeah. Hey. Anyway, I should probably get to the game, right? He's a good boy. Archibald <laughs> is suspended. He's the bestest boy, just like most dogs. Um... Archibald is suspended for one game for his low bridge on Logan Stanley. I'm going to be honest. Wait, I thought this would get a wait, suspension. He's suspended for the rest of the playoffs? <laughs> also, by the way, guys, um, one little quick shout out. This might be a little bit out of, like, normal, but... um, Somewhere there. Where's my goddamn sticker? Green we got vaccinated. Yeah. So I'm officially immortal. Um... <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, please do, guys, though. Oh, my God. The Bruce Wall bench is falling apart. No. It, it, Carter's no. got a Bruce Wall tape ball. Anyway, we're moving on, though. I'm sorry. I'm, I, my mind is not. I, I can't do this. This is nuts. This is nuts. I'm in love with this fucking game. I'm in, this is amazing. So, honestly, I, I like how most of the things in the notes I wrote down that says nervous just happens to do with how I felt more than how the game was. Oh, God. I can't believe we fucking swept at McDavid Oilers. We'll get there. Don't worry. There's a lot of reactions here. Hellebuck is a net. Smith is a net. Both these goalies played their fucking hearts out, and they deserve the credit that they get. Mike Smith is no easy task, and that guy fucking worked so hard. He just he needed something. First period. Wheels gets a chance early in this game. Reaction here. Oh! 
Nice save by Smith. <laughs> wow, good chance. Good nice. passing play. Top stuff. Okay, then Shifley will draw a holding penalty. I'm not. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't really notice this one, but then on the power play, Shifley with a one timer, pretending he's Patrick Laine, but Canadian. Reaction here. Uh, Find your lane. See, that's that one thing where he takes one too much steps to the corner there. I'd like him to just put it on it. Oh, yeah! Woo! Yes! 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 Fuck yeah! Who was it? I think it was KC. Or Shai. Okay, it's Shai. Who cares? Who cares? It's cool. Jet's cool. Yep. In a reaction that feels like it's lifetimes ago, honestly. Good God. Uh, and then McDavid on a wraparound. 1-1. One, one. Yeah, I can hear. Get him. Oh, fuck. Oh, I look blew a tire on that. I know. He couldn't slay. Yeah. <sighs> okay. All right. Jim McDavid will get his first goal of the series, effectively tying Tucker Pullman in goals. Hold your applause, I know. Um, and Oilers fans, by the way, I'm sorry if I come off as cocky. I'm going to be honest, you guys, wow, I can't believe we beat you. And honestly, the fact that three of these games went to overtime, you need to give yourselves a little more credit. There are definitely flaws in your team. You need more insulation. You Losing Athanasio hurt your middle six. And not being able to tender Mike Green retiring hurt your defensive back end and experience value. For the fact the fact that you kept having to go to nurse and bury over and over and over again was hurting your team. You need more depth. You need to figure it out. But with all that said, I respect the fucking effort that you guys put in. You didn't yeah. make a single game easy. Every yeah. single game I'll, 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 was one goal. Oh yeah. Fuck the first game. Two empty netters, one goal game. Four games, one goal game. Yeah. And as much as I will fucking laugh and say, haha, we swept you, you fucking made it. Yeah. I want to make sure that... Feel I'll, like a fucking achievement. Yeah, oh, yeah everything, everything I respect we're doing, that. everything, all this, this is out of excitement. This is, uh, this is not... I this is out of excitement and partially drunkness. Um, <laughs> but anyway, yeah, alcohol, so what alcohol, are we at? Alcohol. We're at 1-1, so McDavid on a great route, we're on trend. McDavid gets another chance, there's a back and forth. There's a bad icing penalty. There's not a bad icing penalty. There's a I bad icing penalty? that goes in our favor. And Nurse fucking screwed. And he's like, the fuck is that? And yeah, he's right. We shouldn't have gotten icing. Forward second like stick out. Back and forth chances. And then Appleton on a beautiful deflection. On a shot that had no business going in the net. Two on Jets reaction here. And then pretty much that's... Yes! Yes! Even the ref didn't react! I didn't even move. Ref didn't even move! I said only David, but we're oh, trying to fucking move. Wow! So the ref doesn't even move. He's in the corner. This is what threw me off. Because, like, I always want to check those things. I don't blame him. But, like, I don't fucking yeah. blame him. Uh, this is sassy chance. Watch. Deke, uh, two one after the first period. I like this first oh, period. Oh, nice. No, just really nice. Prevented it. But, you know, all in all, we were up 2 1. Second period. We started on the power play. It was good power play time. We couldn't do it. And then Ryan Nugent Hopkins on an amazing play to get his own rebound. 2-2. Two, two. Reaction here. I'm putting the ice cream away. Yeah, and you know, that's just a great play by Ryan Nugent New Hopkins. I'm going to be honest, I've heard a couple. Actually, this is one thing I want to say, okay? Because other than that, I've given your team credit, I've given your fans credit. There's a couple people I want to single out now because those people have done amazing work in covering your franchise. Um, and two people I talk to. So, delayed offside, go and subscribe to them because they're awesome. 
Uh, Willie does uh, his takes on the reactions, and he stays so positive, you'd think he'd be strangling a box, box full of kittens. And I mean that in the nicest way. That guy is so sweet and so sincere, and he's so positive about everything, even though he predicted the Oilers to sweep. I'll forgive him on that. And also Josh Warner, because Josh Warner is such a... He's not, he's not a bad person, not at all. He's an amazing person. You should subscribe to him. You should also help him hit... 100 subscribers he's at 97 right now and that and that kid works amazingly hard he works really hard and Wait, you can see he that he's at 97 right now we can help him hit 100 um and i want to shout him out because he covers the oilers covers pretty much every game um and he was really crushed by this series and i don't blame him because expectation just wasn't on the side of the oilers this series um but also and, and please we, but we, please subscribe him that. because he really covers amazing stuff anyway moving on though because i just want to get that out sorry yeah. uh pionk takes a hooking penalty Warriors get a lot of chances. Jets get a rush chance with shots wide. We were jamming our, the slot in our own zone very well. Um, there's a holding penalty that I don't like. Um, it's by PLD, and I didn't like it because it looked like we got tied up in the middle of the zone. And we keep going. Uh, chase on on a rebound on the power play. We make it 3-2. Oilers lead. Reaction. Here. Get him out of there! Damn it! You gotta clear that. <sighs> Stanley takes a slash and penalty. It's a little weak in my opinion. I thought he dropped the stick too easily, but you know what? I'm not gonna get mad because the 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 officiating knew that come overtime they couldn't call fuck all. They called nothing. But we're not even there yet. We're still at the second. Well, period. there was one penalty. Fucking that was called, We'll discuss that. We'll need to discuss why that was called. There were two penalties called in all of the overtimes. So Stanley takes a slash, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oilers pressing. Morrissey takes a cross check penalty. It was too high of a cross check. That's why they had to call it. Five on three, though, for the Oilers. They can't score. We start in the penalty kill. We get a couple chances. And then McDavid gets a chance on a rush. Can't convert. And then he gets decked by Dylan DeMello on a great hit. We need to hit the net. And then Shifley on a beautiful pass and play by the top line. Takes a 3-3 reaction here. Start! they would stay for like hours but let's get before we get to the end let's keep her going so <sighs> dry Seidel was pissed on this one play there's a lot of nerves for me and carter especially watching this game smith makes an amazing save on pld back and forth there's an early whistle late in the third period where we thought we could have scored because the puck bounced out of uh, smith's pads hell of a fucking block by blake wheeler who's sacrificing his own blake wheelers to block the shot <laughs> If you don't get that reference, you've never been hit there. Um, yeah. And now we're going OT. 3-3, three, 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 end of the third, first overtime. Wheels is back. Shifley misses a chance. Yamamoto takes a trip and penalty on Ehlers where he practically accidentally slew Footson. He has to call that penalty. Shifley misses a chance. Nurse bats the puck out of play, but it's very close. It's hard to say if he... The camera is literally cut on the top. We can't tell if it hit the glass or not but I, I think it might have hit glass to be honest but uh, i know jake didn't like this one but you know could have went anywhere or nervous i was just nervous dry side a wide dry side on a rush rush chances for the jets the oilers get so close there's a reaction here oh my. get it out get it out get it out get out get it out get it out uh, i can't believe it oh my i'm getting what you hacks it's gotta go, it's gotta go! We're in trouble here, boy! I thought the Oilers were gonna I thought the Oilers were gonna win. Eulers gets robbed by Mike Smith. Um Uh Eulers gets robbed by Mike Smith. I think there's actually a reaction to that, so I'm gonna ask Carter. No! And you know, that's, that's the, the end of first. That's the end of first overtime. 
Now there's D-Zone time. Yeah, that's the second last one. Okay, good. KLD gets a chance back and forth, back and forth. Scary. There's a lot of D-Zone time. Smith is out of his net. We need to collapse the D. End of the second overtime. The second overtime was all Oilers. It was all Oilers. It was terrifying. And then the third overtime. Haas, Chaitan Haas takes a delay of game. I think that's how you say his name. I'm sorry. I'm really... I'm still pretty drunk, but I'm really trying to get this name because you guys deserve the respect. You, you, you deserve respect because yes, we beat you, but you are. Every time you beat a team in the, in the Stanley Cup playoffs, no matter how much shit talk was made, you need to respect the people you fucking beat because they put up a fight and they made you better for it. So hot sixty delay of game penalty. We can't score in that. Healers, Healers hits the post on one, and then. Kyle Connor, triple overtime. He did it! Ah! Oh, come on, come on! Yeah! Ah! Yeah! 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 Ah! Yeah! Yeah! tears right there because I don't even know what to say I'm I'm speechless this is beyond my wildest predictions this is beyond I thought we'd lose in six we won exactly. in four we fucking won we fucking won give me the hell of hunger give me the hell of fortress you are a god and I love you Hellebuck is a god amongst mere mortals. He's the best Connor in the playoffs. And he played amazingly well tonight. And so did Kyle Connor, the other Connor. And also queuing now our Brossois bench. <laughs> guys, guys, guys. So. What else is there to say? The Jets are going to the second round to play either the Montreal Canadiens or the Toronto Maple Leafs. First off, three stars of this game. Three stars. Honorable mention will be Nikolai Ehlers. He was so close on so many chances. Actually, no. It'll be a tie between Nikolai Ehlers and Blake Wheeler. Blake Wheeler laying his body out there. Shifley, third star. Two goals in a game. Amazing play. Second. Connor Hellebuck. He was stellar out there. And then first has to be the overtime winner himself. Kyle frickin' Connor. First AFC. start. Mike Award. Go fuck. Doesn't matter. Mike Go. Awards don't matter in this. We fucking did it. I can't believe we did it! I'm sorry if I feel a little burnt out right now, guys. I'm just... I've been screaming for hours. And it's not even for another thing that I can make a joke about that I won't make a joke about because this show is technically family friendly. Um, <laughs> hey, it, it's run by a family of people, therefore family friendly. Um, There's definitely a gray area in there. <laughs> yeah, but like guys, we either play the Oilers, not the Oilers. We we fucked up the Oilers. We either play the Canadians or the Leafs. And this is something that's important because I need to say this. To be the man, you have to beat the man. Toronto, you are the man. If the Canadians beat you, they are the man. If they don't, you are still the man. So therefore, we need to beat you. Because as a great champion Ric Flair says, to be the man, you have to beat the man. You are the man, and we await the challenge, whoever it may be. 
All is fair in the game of fucking hockey, it seems. Especially ask, if you ask Tom Wilson. My god, this was a fucking amazing game. I am hyped. Let's fucking celebrate. We focus on round two tomorrow. Tonight is ours. Thank you for fucking watching because this was amazing to record. Jose Bautista. I didn't need that light. Um, thank you for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe because that's fucking amazing. We're trying to hit 450 by the end of the month. We're actually somehow fucking close to that. Don't forget to fucking subscribe to my buddy's Hot Garbage Sports run by Coach Ryan D. And, uh, yeah, I, I like your enthusiasm. And fucking Jake from Peg City Hockey, who's a fucking beauty. Yes. Subscribe to them. Check out some of our other content if you're in the mood. Because who the fuck isn't in the mood? Because we're fucking one, boys! And don't forget to leave a like to show that you, that you enjoy this. And comment down below your thoughts on this game. We fucking did it!